Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am super excited today because I finally got my hands on some Moisture Milk by Pattern. And even better, I'm twinning. I've never matched with a product in my life in a hair video. So we know this is gonna be the absolute best wash day. So if you're new here, I am Nicole. I do hair videos typically. I've switched over here recently and started doing a bunch of different kind of videos, but my love and main content is hair. And if you've been watching my vlogs or any of my videos here recently, you know I've been trying out a lot of new products. And one type of product that I have been trying out a lot recently is mousse. And so I've tried two from The Do, one from Miche, and then of course, the one by Pattern Beauty and I got the small one because I just wanted to test it out and see. And I actually did, I only used that mousse on my hair and while it was okay the first day, it was not very moisturizing. I did not feel like my hair um, could last past that one day. Um, but for the first day, I actually did like it. But one thing I did want to try was it with a leave-in because unlike some of the other mousses I've tried, I'm still trying to figure out that word, y'all. Mousse, mousses, type down below. How am I supposed to say that word? Anyways, unlike some of the other ones, this does not say used by itself. Actually, it says... It actually says pro tip on here cocktail in a few drops of pattern argon oil blend or the jojoba oil blend with leave-in conditioner for extra moisture and shine so um i have also been trying out this detangling nectar by pattern and i was going to pair these two together because i actually really really like this one but then i saw her ad for this one and it just caught my attention i was really drawn to it and so I wanted to try it out. I've actually watched a few videos and everybody was like, they really liked it. And then I happened upon Happy Girl, Happy Girl, Miss Reyna, and she paired these two together. So I was like, it must be a go because anything she pairs, any product she tries, my hair typically likes it. I'm ready to try this out. Like I said, I really did like the detangling nectar, um, but I, I was just more excited to try this out. Now, if I pair these together, and it does not look promising. I have a little bit left of my Stronghold Gel on deck, just in case. Just spraying my hair down a little bit to get it back damp because it started drying out. I don't think I've been this excited to try a new product in a while, just because of the claims and what different people have been saying. I'm like, this might be what I need because my curls get really dry. So it is very creamy off the bat okay okay moisture i like how it glides through my hair my hair was already detangled so there was no need to detangle but it does glide through very nicely and it says you can apply as little or as much as you want i'm a little heavy-handed um and i've really been liking mousse here lately even though it's fall almost fall and the weather's changing i like the mousse because the ones i've tried to give me hold but because my hair is so thin it also gives me like some body and doesn't look so flat so that's all in i think i'm going to go all over my head and apply the moisture milk first and then come back and do the mousse this one says thirsty curls drink in lightweight hydration when you smooth our moisture milk through parched strands ideal for moisture that lasts all day this creamy formula leaves strands shiny and supple so it has rich almond oil irish moss and agave nectar softens the curls to reduce breakage and finesse unwanted frizz perfect for providing daily moisture and refreshing twist outs and wash and goes keeping your texture juicy and joyful so it does say that you should style it on wet or dry hair, apply a little or liberally depending on your hair type, and like I said before, you can cocktail with some of the oil or serum from Patterns Lime. So the main thing she says about this is that the leave-in is a conditioner and the moisture milk is a moisturizer. And so really and truly, I think this can be put on top of a leave-in 
and styled like that if you want like a more fluffy look or like when you get to the colder months instead of using a lightweight leave-in you can use this as your leave-in and then put a gel or heavier cream on top of it so it seems like it'd be very like versatile which i like In the power of his blood. I wish y'all could see this. So, one of the things Tracy mentioned on her Instagram was that the moisture milk is oil-based and I can definitely feel the oil. So now I'm ready to try the mousse on top. Very lightweight and moisturizing in my hand. However, when I applied it on its own, it was not. But I, I like the idea of mousse giving you this lightweight, bouncy feel. And there are some that are very moisturizing on their own. This one just didn't say to use it on its own necessarily. Like it said, you can use it with other stuff. So I think it probably works better when you mix it with stuff. But putting these together, like it feels so good. And I'm doing the whole section because my hair is pretty moisturized with the moisture milk. So I really just need a topper. I will go through and smooth it into my roots because my roots tend to be really puffy and then um, it's thicker than the rest of my hair so it kind of is making my hair look weird now because all of the hair that is growing in is growing in a little bit thicker because I went through this like thinning phase so make sure I get my root and comment down below if you have tips for thinning hair one thing I've been having to do which I don't enjoy is like fluffing and picking my hair and like really kind of messing it up to make it look good because the ends are so much thinner but y'all this feels so good together like this feels like a winning combo but we shall see it's the day two and three that let me know if it's a winning combo so i'm gonna finish this all up and then i will come back with the final results okay so my thoughts so far is it feels really good um honestly i can feel the oil and so i'm almost thinking this might be a good product to do the lock method with so like a leave-in and then this because it has that oil in it i also do like putting it on alone and putting something on top of it just like a light layer of hold and she did say that this has a light hold so i don't know maybe alone one product who knows I'm definitely gonna keep playing with it but I'm gonna let my air I'm going to let my hair air dry and then diffuse it and come back and I'll probably go ahead and stretch it and everything before I come back <laughs> my hair is why am I my hair is so and it feels so moisturized there's absolutely no hold like it ain't gonna last but a few days but the beautiful thing about this is that it's so moisturized that i literally can probably just why do i keep i could probably just wet it add a little of this or add a little of this or even add a little of this and stretch it by just refreshing it instead of starting completely over because it's so moisturized which i like because about day three four and just some mornings i literally wet my hair down put a little leave-in or style on it and diffuse it again just to have that fresh look Whew. i can't stop i can't stop touching my hair y'all it feels so soft now i did not really stretch it but this side tends to, like, my front pieces tend to hang longer. Um, it's a looser curl pattern than the rest of my hair. And so when I diffused it, this side kind of fluffed and this side is kind of, so I'm going to have to, like, pick it. But I didn't really want to mess with it because I wanted you all to see it. Like, y'all. And it has so much volume. Like, it is crazy. Like, I when I say I didn't pick it, I didn't do any kind of stretching like this was just the result of me doing my diffusing process with making sure my roots was getting dry and this so in the future i probably 
will try this as my styler and something else as my leave-in or try this but with a gel on top if I want more hold and it to last longer but when I tell y'all I think I found me a new I am not a moisture milk girl I have never really been into moisture milks and here lately just like mousse y'all I, I my hair is changing I am changing and honestly I'm glad I'm stepping out of my comfort zone and trying new things because I am in love y'all and I think I need a cut so that my hair will kind of act right. I just cut it but I cut it while it was straight so like look look it doesn't even look thin y'all like oh my god there's like I I ain't got nothing else to say. I have nothing else to say. I absolutely love it's not gonna have much hold so if you do this combo know you're gonna get some fluffy juicy curls uh no crunch no hold so comment down below let me know if you tried either one of these products or if you've tried this combo together and i'll see you all in the next one bye guys